you're basically looking for a part of yourself in somebody else、mm-hmm. in order to feel whole and complete, or safe and secure, or being able to be vulnerable, but while also being protected. So you've got all these different dynamics, and they're basically being once again looked for externally in order for an internal wholeness to be felt. And then when you were talking about being alone and being isolated, a lot of people can't sit with themselves, and the reason they can't is because of all of this conditioning from previous. But also because if you were to sit with yourself, then the only thing that you've got is like me, myself, and I, which is just a set of thoughts in our head based on our conditioning from childhood, based on all of the voices of the people that we grew up with that weren't necessarily congruent. With who we are as individuals,、mm-hmm. so when we then go back to that isolation or alone feeling,、mm-hmm. then we have people in our head who aren't us from all of that conditioning from when we learned survival as a child. But then, because we're then sat alone, we've got to the stage where we've been domesticated from that period of time. But now we're self-domesticating. Because we've associated ourselves with those voices,、mm-hmm. and then what we do is we get attached to that feeling.